Hey everyone, today I'll show you how to set up and install a D-Link camera using the My D-Link app. In the box, you should have received a camera, a power adapter, and a quick install guide. For the setup, I will be using an Android phone. However, if you're using an iPhone or an iPad, the steps will be similar. Now, in order to set up the camera, you need to download the My D-Link app from the Google Play Store if you're using an iPhone or an iPad, you can download it from the App Store. Launch the Google Play Store on your device, search for MyD-Link, and install the app. To begin, launch the MyD-Link app. If you're new to the MyD-Link service, then you'll need to create a MyD-Link account. Tap on Create a New Account and follow the on-screen prompts. I already have a MyD-Link account, so I'm going to use it to sign in. The camera will be discovered via Bluetooth. Please make sure Bluetooth is enabled on your phone. Tap Add Device or tap the menu icon on the top left, then Add Device. Tap Scan to scan the QR code. The QR code can be found on the bottom or the back of the camera and on the Quick Install Guide. With some cameras, the QR code may be found on the power adapter wire. Tap Scan. Depending on the model you're installing, if the camera has an Ethernet port, you will be asked how you want to install it. If your camera supports Wi-Fi only, you will not see this option. In this example, we will set up the camera via wireless, so I will tap Wi-Fi. Plug in the camera to a power outlet. Once the LED starts to flash amber, tap Next. Your device will now try to discover and connect to the camera. The camera will now scan for available Wi-Fi networks. Select the Wi-Fi network you want to connect the camera to. In this example, my network is called Home. If you don't see your network listed, tap the refresh icon at the top right to rescan the wireless network list. Enter the Wi-Fi password for the network you just selected. Once done, tap Confirm. Your camera is linking to the MyD-Link server. Here you will have the option to change the camera's name and set up a designated contact. You can assign a designated contact from your contact list on your phone. This will allow you to call your contact from the notification alert window. This is an optional setting and you can configure this at a later time as well. Tap next. The install is now complete. Tap done. An automation rule will be created automatically so that you get a push notification when a person or motion is detected. This will depend on your model of the camera. This can be changed and customized later. Tap OK. For configuring person detection, we recommend mounting the camera between 6.5 to 8 feet for best results. It's best to follow the on screen prompts for optimal mounting instructions. Tap Got It. Scenes is a feature of the MyD-Link app that allows you to quickly and easily turn off and on privacy mode or an automation. This is an optional setting and can be configured at a later time. I don't need to set up the scenes, so I will just tap I'll set up myself. If your camera supports cloud recording, follow the on-screen prompts to subscribe. This can also be set up at a later time. For now, I will just tap on Later on the top right. The installation is complete and you can now view your camera. Thank you for watching. For more videos and other helpful resources on how to get the most out of your D-Link device, please visit support.dlink.ca or support.dlink.com.